So, being a, a long time wrestling fan, uh, even if you're not, uh, if you're a relatively new wrestling fan, I think it's always good to kind of go back in time, travel back in time, and familiarize yourselves with, you know, the pioneers of the sport. One of those pioneers of the sport, you know, I remember him on Saturday, WCW Saturday night on TBS 605. Beautiful Bobby Eaton. But he had, he had a um, career before that, which I'm you know, very familiar with. Midnight Express has to be one of my favorite tag teams of all time. A lot of that comes down to Bobby Eaton, uh, who passed away, uh, 62 years old. Beautiful uh, Bobby Eaton. One of the best wrestlers uh, that didn't get the recognition as being a, a great wrestler outside of the tag scene, the tag scene. More to him than just a tag wrestler. And it's a damn shame. He had great charisma and incredible in-ring talent. Still, he is one of the great legends of the tag team scene. Coming on in an era that I would consider to be the golden age of tag team wrestling. Standing out when just the NWA alone has teams such as Road Warriors and the Freebirds. It's not an easy task. But the Midnight Express, with Bobby Eaton, did just that and became the hottest act that the NWA had for a long time. And JCP, NWA, they won seven, several tag team titles and faced literally some of the best tag teams that existed at the time. While he was known for his tag team work, when he did work in a singles match, he brought a high level of skill to the ring. His so matches to me were always trying was were always him trying to be at his best. It's no wonder that the Wrestling Observer, the newsletter, named him most underrated for four separate years. Aside from JP uh, JCP, Eaton uh, worked in various capacities for SMW, Mid South, New Japan, WCW, CWA. And WCCW. Eaton is one of the few, I think, one of the few legends in this era that never worked for the WWF or WWE. Many wrestlers, as Mick Foley, Steve Austin, they rated him as one of the best in ring and a pleasure to work with. Foley, I remember, even said that Bobby Eaton was one of the nicest people ever in the business. Think he was a true legend in Bobby Eaton and has earned that respect. If you've never seen him work, go take a couple hours on YouTube and start trying to watch some Midnight Express matches. You'll be glad you did. Hope all's well.